Okay, so I usually don't show PHP Storm features like this. I don't want this channel to be a marketing channel for PHP Storm. That's not my job. My job is to empower developers. And actually, there is this new feature in PHP Storm that I think is pretty cool. So I wanted to share it with you. Let me know your thoughts about it in the comments, how you feel about that. Uh, and let me let me show you what's uh, what's going on. In the newest PHP Storm, there is this, this feature, uh, the improved logger, basically. Let me open uh, this log file here. Now, if you opened log files in PHP Storm before, uh, you might notice two differences here. The first one is uh, there are colors, uh, a lot of colors. We're going to talk about that. The second thing here is, uh, let me open this file again. Uh, it's, it's a bit more subtle, but it is a, a big performance improvement. Now, if I scroll this file, notice my uh, my my scroll bar there at the top. Yeah, this is a big file. This is a big log file. And still PHP Storm is able to open it almost instantly and highlight the code. It wasn't possible before. I actually had a colleague uh, who, who wrote a new highlight renderer. I don't know the details, but a, a highlight renderer for log files specifically, which only highlights like the parts that are visible in the viewport, something like that. And it makes it so that, yeah, even huge log files they can be highlighted and uh, shown like super performantly and that's that's pretty cool that's something that wasn't uh, wasn't possible before um, another another feature here is that you can also click uh, paths now uh, that all works and then there are the colors of course i already mentioned that let me uh, open my uh, settings here you can actually change these colors because by default uh, i i made a little uh, little adjust adjustment here already um, by default it's something like like this and it's just a, a bit too intense for me, a bit too many colors. But uh, just wanted to, to let you know that you can change these colors. You can uh, configure formats here. And uh, there are some pre-configured formats for WordPress, Symfony and Laravel are enabled by default. There are some more here as well. I think like, let me check here, packages. I think monologue is like the de facto standard for PHP logging these days. Um, yeah, 700 and uh, um, 700 million, right, uh, installs. So yeah, we can be pretty sure that if if you're using a framework or if you're using Monolog, um, these formats uh, should suffice. Each format it consists of, of different patterns here and you can style them accordingly. You can make your own if you want to, but like I said, I don't think that will be really necessary. Uh, but if you want to, the possibility is there. Now, one last thing I want to show you is that this also works when tailing a log file. So uh, let's tail here like this. You can already see there's highlighting. But if we uh, go to the controller here, like my home controller, and uh, write a, a log statement like this. Let's see. Let's go to RFC photo test. Sure. So uh, this, this is writing here live. And when, when exceptions are thrown like so, uh, then the output is here and it's styled properly as well. So that's pretty cool. So yeah, that's uh, that's the new log file support in PHP Storm. I wanted to let you know about it because I think it's, it's a small thing, but it will be super helpful in our day-to-day -day developer life. Let me know what you think about it in the comments and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.